got to smoke free for some guppies. Check it out, Father. We're here at the Tamaki Makoto Heat for Smoke Free Pacifica Beats 2012. These guys are competing and trying to get their hands on the grand final prize. It's amazing. I'm talking about a song recorded, video clip, thousands of dollars of music vouchers. It is the Smoke Free Pacifica Beats, boy. Check it out. Hey, you, we have been emceeing last year and this year, this is the second time for me for the Smoke Free Pacifica Beats, um, going all up and down Aotearoa, and it's quite exciting the amount of acts that you get to see and the talent. I grew up doing Rock Quest through high school, and um, yeah, it's a pretty amazing opportunity for uh, high school people, you know, it's getting to play on a stage and in front of the crowd and get just giving it gives you something to work towards. Yeah, they get really good results out of it too. I've heard some cool music today, so yeah. I'll just finish from home here. It's just find it relaxing in a way. Like you go through like a whole day of stress and stuff, and then all you do is just write music, and it just this is the stress like right off your chest there. Eh? Yeah. I feel like myself when I write music and stuff. I'm here to speak to the kids about songwriting. I'm a member of the New Zealand Music Commission, and basically I go around the schools and I just teach kids about music, not about the theory work. I'm teaching them actually about the music industry, how to get into it, how to target certain markets. And basically, that's what I want to do here. I want to share my knowledge and my experiences with these kids and hopefully it'll help them with their career in music. Well, Smoke Free Pacifica Beats is always um, a little bit more reggae, I guess, than Rock Quest Smoke Free. Um, but I think this year there's a little bit more uh, female mana wahine coming through and it's, it's really impressive to see the confidence that they have. Uh, with the guys, I'm loving the fact that they're getting up and they're incorporating the reggae with the rap and also their gospel singing as well. Um, I like the feeling that it's coming through. So it's a pretty positive vibe.